A preparation for the uh, individual time trial is absolutely vital to get right. And we're here today at the Vuelta with the BMC's Marco Panotti, who's the current and multiple Italian TT champ, to talk us through his routine. Marco, thanks for joining us today. I know it's extremely important that you get the warm-up right, but you'll be, would you be kind enough of to talk us through exactly what your routine is before an important TT like this? Yeah, the routine is to, stand, to go on the roll about 30, 35 minutes before the start, then do five minutes warm-up, then do a couple of progressions to the treasure, and stay at treasure for one or two minutes, and then uh, just a couple of sprint of six, eight seconds, and then uh, cool down. So with the recovery, it, it will take uh, from 20 to 25 minutes, depending on uh, the weather. If it's hot, I keep it a little bit shorter. If it's cold, I may be a bit longer. And then jump off the trainer 10 minutes before the start, dress, and then go. Now, I know from speaking to you earlier on, you rode around the course yesterday. What do you think of this course? Because we went round today in the car. It looks quite difficult and very, very technical indeed, especially riding on a low-profile bicycle. It's a course, basically it's half course, it's uh, always uphill with a real climb of uh, about 8 to 9 kilometers from 4 to 5 percent average but, but some part even steeper and then uh, very very fast downhill exposed to crosswind and then a 5k flat and then down in the first, the last 5k too. Now the final part of the course there's some big crosswinds now. In terms of your wheels, I know you're going to keep a rear disc on, but what about for the front profile on, on the front wheel? In the front, I choose the low rim wheel because, you know, I crash in Mediterranean condition, like windy. So I prefer to stay on the, on the safe side of the, of the wheel. Now, without giving away too many, too many secrets, on a course like this, bearing in mind this is, uh, you know, in the middle of a, of a grand tour, can you give us an idea of what your kind of the, the kind of power you'll be looking to average over the 38 kilometer course, just approximately? You know, before on the uphill part, I would try to see just above the threshold, and then uh, which is be around 380 watts, and then uh, then only it's difficult to say because most of the down you go more than 70 k an hour, and so it doesn't work pedaling. So and then in the final part you go as hard as possible. What gearing have you chosen today? So what have you got on the front and what have you got on the rear? The front 5441 and the back 1125. Will you start with a full bottle of liquid or will you start with half a bottle? Half a bottle, yeah. Always saving the weight? Yeah. <laughs> of course, this race is midway through a Grand Tour. You've ridden some very hard mountain stages. How are you feeling and what do you think your chances are today? I think I hope to, to make a, a good, uh, this is a good sign of test, a good test for my form. A, a goal achievable, I think it's a top 10 for me. Okay. Marco Pinotti, el corredor de BMC, y otros dos hombres que tiene que marcar buenas referencias. TT tomorrow there's a lot of work for Klaus to do and obviously his colleagues so Klaus take us through exactly what you do in relation to getting these these bikes ready